Maybe it's all the fantasy football owners out there, but a question that I seem to get more than just about anything else about the Ravens is who's going to be the starting running back? Everyone wants to know who's going to be the workhorse in the backfield from week to week. We all talked about Danny Woodhead coming into the season, but then he went down in week one and Terrence West, it looked like he'd be the feature back. Then all of a sudden Alex Collins seemed to emerge out of nowhere and everyone was excited about him. But then last week, Terrence West went down and the Ravens turned to Buck Allen to get 21 carries. So now maybe he's the guy. He's the hot hand right now. It seems like it's someone new every single week. And my prediction is this. That's just the way it's going to be. All these running backs bring something a little different to the table. And rather than anointing anyone as the guy, the Ravens are just going to ride the hot hand and see who's deserving of the most carries on Sunday. That certainly could be Buck Allen again this week. And Coach Harbaugh talked today about his development. For him to have a vision, I think he's he's been very determined. You know, he's worked really hard. He's probably you know, not happy with the fact that he hasn't, you know, broken out earlier. But you know, it takes a lot of hard work. And I think for him to understand the type of back that he is, you know, his own skill set, what he does best, I think he's coming into his own that way, you know. And he's a versatile guy. He's very smart. He can do a lot of things in all three phases of the offense. So, you know, I'm pretty excited about him. And there's things he can get better at. You know, he'll tell you that, you know, in terms of uh, just the way he carries the ball and maybe getting some more yards after contact. Those are things he's working on. So we'll see how all this plays out on Sunday against the Bears, and we actually have a few tickets left to that game, so make sure you jump on those quickly before all of them are gone, and you can find more info about those at BaltimoreRavens.com slash tickets. That's it for me on the final drive today, but thanks for watching, everyone, and we'll see all of you again tomorrow.